YouTubers have been quitting bed wars and moving on to different games. What is the true reason behind all of this? In today's video, I will be talking about some well-known YouTubers who have moved on from bed wars or have quit YouTube entirely. Also, I'm giving away three kits when I hit 20k, so subscribe for that. Roblox Bed Wars is a popular multiplayer game mode where players compete in teams to destroy each other's beds and eliminate their opponents. However, in recent times, many prominent YouTubers who used to create content on Roblox Bed Wars have announced their departure from the game. One reason behind this could be the increasing toxicity and negativity in the community, with players resorting to cheating and hacking to win. Another factor could be the lack of significant updates and improvements in the game, leading to a sense of monotony and boredom among players. Moreover, with the rise of other games and trends in the gaming industry, Bed Wars may have lost its appeal to content creators, prompting them to switch to other games with more potential for growth in it. Anyways, let's begin with the first YouTuber, Adarix. Adarix was a well-known YouTuber with over 30k subscribers and made short videos on gameplay. He was known as one of the best mobile players because of his building and PvP skills. 2022 was really good year for his channel, and his views even peaked with over 5 million views just in the month of January. But after the month of July, he started uploading less, making his views go down. Even though the reasons were not specified, according to me, it must have been because of bed wars being repetitive and most videos' ideas already being done. Do you know the true reason on why he quit? Let me know in the comments. Moving on, the next YouTuber we are talking about is TruckHitter567. He was an OG YouTuber and one of my friends who started his Bed Wars career with short gameplay and outplay videos. Later, he started doing long-form content which people loved. Right now, he has over 65k subscribers, but barely uploads any videos. The month of June to September 2021 was the peak for his channel, where he gained over 6 million views and almost 25k subscribers. The reason for him barely uploading was explained in a way in this video, where he shared about Bedware's ideas being repetitive, forcing him to do the same video ideas over and over, instead of doing outside-the-box ideas like he used to do. Go watch his video if you want to know more about it. The next YouTuber on the list is Rojo Efe. Rojo Efe is a Bedwares YouTuber with over 100k subscribers, who actually started a new style of content in Bedwars with his unique thumbnail style and the FNF music to his videos. His first Bedwars video was uploaded on the 29th of December 2021. The video did decent, currently having over 10k views. He later started posting gameplay videos which really took off during the month of March, May of 2022, gaining his channel over 12 million views in just 2-3 to three months. His last video was posted 5 months ago, and by taking a look at his community posts, we can assume that he won't be uploading any Bed Wars content anytime soon. Next up we have one of the most well-known mobile Bed Wars YouTubers, JN Protagonist. He was one of the OG Bed Wars creators, who uploaded his first Bed Wars video on the 10th of June 2021 titled The Craziest Roblox Bed Wars Doubles Clutch Ever. The video currently has over 120k views right now, so it did good. JN was someone whom a lot of mobile players looked up to and even wanted to be like him. His videos are pretty unique ideas and his thumbnail style was pretty good as well. But his last Bed Wars video was five months ago. After that, he started uploading Blocks Fruits videos and has now switched to that game. His Blocks Fruits content seems to be doing better than his Bed Wars content, so switching was a really good idea from his side. The reason he must have switched at that time because at the time, most YouTubers were switching because they ran out of good video ideas to do, and Blocks Fruits YouTube audience was doing way better than Bed Wars. This must have been the reason he switched but I still see comments in his new videos where people ask him to go back to Bed Wars. Next up, we have a YouTuber with a star code. Can you guess who I'm talking about? I'm talking about Mud Plays. Mud Plays started doing Bed Wars a year ago, before which he used to do some Murder Mystery 2 content. He used to do update videos, gameplay, news, and all varieties of Bed Wars content. But now he has moved on to Pet Simulator X content, and the reason for this can be explained through his community post where he stated that he was taking a break from Bed Wars content and was going to try out some Pet Sim X content. 
This might be a positive change for his channel, but if it doesn't work out, I feel like he's going to be back and upload more Bed Wars content. Also, if you are still here, comment nice hacks in the comments to confuse others. Let me know honestly in the comments. Do you still enjoy playing Bed Wars even now? I mean, sure, the updates are getting better, but I feel like the objective is still the same, making it pretty boring to play. Here is a short compilation of the profile pictures of YouTubers who either switched or quit YouTube entirely. Don't worry, I'll make it really short. The next YouTuber is someone with almost 4 million subscribers. Try to guess who it is about. Zach started the channel in 2015 and has since amassed over 10 million subscribers, making it one of the most popular channels on YouTube. He initially gained popularity for his Minecraft content, including Let's Play videos and tutorials. As the channel grew, Zach started to branch out into other games like Roblox and Among Us. He used to do a lot of roleplay-styled Roblox Bedwars videos, which really gained popularity and peaked. But later it became pretty repetitive, and the video ideas were pretty much the same. He then switched into Roblox Blocks Fruits roleplay content, on which he still posts videos on. The videos get 150k to 300k views per video, which is really good. One possible reason is that Zachary may have wanted to explore other types of content or games beyond Roblox Bedwars. Content creators often need to constantly adapt and evolve their content to keep their audience engaged and attract new viewers, and switching things up can be a way to achieve that. Another possible reason could be burnout or a lack of interest in the game. Creating content can be a demanding and time-consuming process, and it's possible that Zachary may have felt burnt out or lost interest in Roblox Bed Wars after creating content for it for a long period of time. It's also possible that there were other factors involved in Zachary's decision to quit Roblox Bed Wars content that are not publicly known. Ultimately, only Zachary himself can provide the exact reasons for his decision. And there you have it. A glimpse into the world of Roblox Bed Wars and the YouTubers who once graced its virtual battlegrounds. While they may have moved on to new endeavors, their legacy lives on through the countless hours of gameplay footage and memories they've left behind. It's a reminder that even in a virtual world, the bonds and communities we build are very real. As we bid farewell to these former Bed Wars champions, let's remember to honor and appreciate the impact they've had on the game and its community. Who knows, maybe we'll see them back on the battlefield again someday. Until then, happy gaming.